First at 11, a special tree lighting ceremony downtown Firebaugh tonight. Family and friends coming together to honor the life of Melanie Camacho on what would have been her 20th birthday. She disappeared a week ago today. Her remains were found later in an orchard. CBS 47's Juanita Adame has reaction from tonight's tree lighting and vigil. Well, this is the tree here in downtown Fireball that's been set up to honor Melanie Camacho. A small vigil has also been placed here at the foot of the tree to remember the 19 year old aspiring teacher. A Christmas tradition in the town of Fireball that's been the same for more than two decades. We've been doing it uh, since I started working here 27 years ago. Each year, the first week of December, residents come downtown to watch the city's tree light up. To keep Melanie's memory alive and ensure that she is never forgotten, we have come together to light the city's Christmas tree in, in her honor. Tonight, however, that tradition changed. And from now on, lighting the city's tree will have an entirely different meaning. It's very heartwarming because it's, I mean, it's not something that you expect, I mean, especially with everything that we're, we're going through and dealing with um, during this hard time. It was just one week ago that Melanie Camacho disappeared after leaving her job at AutoZone in Madera. Her body was discovered one day later in a nearby orchard. Melanie's ex-boyfriend and his friend have been charged with her murder. Seeing all the support and um, they could not believe it. Um, this is something that has never You've not, we've never seen here in Fireball. Maria Romero is related to Melanie and said the family is extremely thankful for the outpour of support. She loved music. Um, I will say um, one thing about her is she loved ki kids. Uh, she wanted, like you guys heard previously, she wanted to be a teacher. Tonight, Melanie was supposed to be celebrating her 20th birthday. But now family will instead have to prepare a funeral. This is an unexpected um, situation that happened. A realization that still has not set in. You know, we want to keep um, her name, you know, always out there for everyone to remember her, you know, who she was. Beautiful, young, um, you know, daughter that um, she was, you know, still had time, a lot of time, a lot of things that she wanted to do in life. Now, the family has also set up a page. You can find that link on our website, yourcentralvalley.com. Reporting in Fireball, Juanita Adama, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.